What's good, you guys, and welcome on today's episode. If you are here for the very first time, thank you so much for being here today. A few days ago, I shared a clip from Fox News where the host was talking about how Trump knows what he's doing. He knows what to do to call on the black people to support and vote for him. He said that Trump already know that black people love sneakers so much and they will put their priorities aside and vote for him because they love sneakers and they love what he's doing. So they will vote for Trump because of sneakers. And we all can tell how freaking insulting that is to black people's intelligence to think that they don't have anything important to worry about. They don't have that much priorities to be bothered about. They are going to literally vote for a candidate because he released a shoe line and shoes are like charm to black people we are still on that conversation when trump said another thing and this clip has been going viral so without wasting much time let me just roll the clip that he's currently going viral again and then i got indicted a second time and a third time and a fourth time and a lot of people said that that's why the black people like me because they have been hurt so badly and discriminated against and they actually viewed me as i'm being discriminated against it's it's been pretty amazing no 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 between this comment he's saying right now about indictments and being criminalized and what the folks said about inner city people loving sneakers this might just be worse than hillary clinton talking about having hot sauce in the bag or joe biden saying if you don't vote for me then you ain't black i think it might be worse it's giving racial pathology pandering tap dancing or no nah. and then think about it in 2020 and 2021, when we were rallying for support for George Floyd, they told us our community is too quick to get behind supporting a criminal. And now look at him trying to get us to support a goddamn criminal. I mean, he really said it's exciting that they view me as being discriminated. Tell us that he ain't pissing on our hands and then telling us that it's raining. When you think about it, white privilege is being able to run for commander in chief of the free world while still facing more indictments than Suge Knight. Perhaps this is why he passed that first step act, because he knew he was going to get into some federal trouble, huh? If you go back and listen to the clip, you can kind of hear him calling us the N-word in his breath. Go back you. <laughs> what do you guys think about that clip? There are some people pissed at what he said, and there are some people literally making light and jokes from that video. And there are some set of people who are pissed at the people who are making jokes at him because they believe this is very insulting. So there's nothing funny. But I would like to hear what you guys think about that clip and what he said about black people in the comment section just like consciously said he said he's literally pissing on our hands and telling us that it is raining and that seems like a perfect summary of everything that he said like that's the perfect way to just describe what he's trying to say in true sense so i'd like to hear what you guys think about that and the fact that there are people in the room clapping and who are the people in the room is it the same white people who say that black people don't face discrimination clapping at the fact that Trump was confirming that black people face discrimination and trying to attach himself or his situation to black people or codedly saying that black people support criminal activities and they would definitely support him like i would like to hear what you guys think about that in the comment section like it was dead as serious saying that freaking serious like it was saying something very very okay like this person said trump is a lot of things but an oppressed minority is not one of them we are not done with the conversation of the host literally insulting black people's intelligence saying they are going to put away their priorities and vote for someone because they release their sneaker line we are not done with that and this is on the table already trying to you know put themselves into the struggle of black people because they're about to gain something or they want to gain something from it they only claim to understand black people's pain and struggle when they are about to benefit from it if it is the other way around they will literally shit on black people so i would like to hear what you guys think about that video in the comment section let me know your thoughts let's continue this conversation there and i will see you guys in the next one bye and i love you guys